Hello and welcome to an all new comic corner. Today, I'm going to be talking about this little book from Scout Comics called Ninja Dun Nuns. I just read this. It says parental advisory. I understand. And it's the first printing. I imagine there will be others. But, um,. No, I'm not worried. Before anybody asks, I'm not worried about taking it out. There's imperfections. There's like dings all up through it. Um, that's how it was when I bought it. So, anyway, this it's like an anthology in the book. There's four stories. Uh, it's called None the Wiser, Rise of the Discomancer. Far Out and Concred. Um, I'm not sure who the create Bob France and Kevin Cuff seem to be the creators. That's who holds the copyright. And the stories are written by Bob France, Kevin Cuff. Uh, well, they wrote three of them. And the first story in here, None the Wiser, is written by Chaz Pangborn. Now, each one has a different artist. So... The art on each story is different, but that's not to say they're not bad. Even the third one, which is uh, the Ninja Nuns uh, at a concert. The artwork isn't bad. I mean, it's kind of simplistic, and it reminds me of... Um, well, I can, I don't know, it reminds me of something, I can't quite tell what it reminds me of, but, it's not bad. Anyway, the four stories in here, and I, I'm, I'm assuming they're gonna keep going, cause this has number one, and it doesn't say one shot, and I love the cover, love the cover, I don't know if there's any others, you can check out Scout Comics, or your local comic shop, to see if they have a copy. I might actually get another one just because I got dings through it. And then give this one to Matt because that's what he deserves. A dinged up comment. No, I'm just kidding. Man. But the first one, it drew me in. Like, it talks about all the different gods or some. And then you find out that this guy who's summoning a god ends up summoning, oh, uh, what is it? What's his name? Tony with an I. The Cosmic God of Tantric Constipation. I know. It's great. Like, how can you not like a book that has a Tantric God of Constipation in it? Look, that's what the guy looks like. In the story, this guy who's summoning him says he thought he was summoning the God of Wealth and... Prosperity, but that wasn't the case. And a ninja nun comes and saves him. Um, the second story, the disco monster, is like this DJ who takes and turns a statue of Mary Magdalene into a DJ and starts a party inside a church. And the three ninja nuns come and try to stop him. Do they? You'll have to buy the book to find out. The third book is, uh, I mean, the third uh, story, which is this one, it shows the ninja nuns starting off in their headquarters. And then they go to find a god that this hippie band took and um, captured to get high. I know, right? Uh, or deity. They don't come out and say gods for the most part. They say deities. And the deity they find, 
that is trapped by this band is none other than the Flying Spaghetti Monster. So in this universe, the universe of the Ninja Nuns, seems like all deities are, uh, you know, real. And they have to go, uh, the Ninja Nuns go and stop the bad ones or stuff to try to keep them contained. Uh, it's, overall it's a good, a good book. It's a good read. It's not too serious. Just go check it out. It's five dollars. Is it worth five dollars? You know what? Yes, yes. I enjoyed reading all four stories. It's like the last story is only like two, maybe three pages, but the rest of the story is worth it. Uh, but so yeah, go check it out. You. You will not be sorry, in my opinion. Um, just like I said, there's a god of tantric constipation. How can you not like that? Artwork's good. Um, phenomenal. In three of the four stories. And even the one that I didn't really dig the artwork, I still kind of dug it. Um, it was like a throwback, something I, I can't even place where I've seen it before, but I know I've seen that style before, and while it's not terrific, it's not bad. So yeah, those are my thoughts. Our Ninja Nuns, go check it out. Um, so I think you can actually get, you can also get, if you don't want to go out and buy the actual comic, you can get a digital copy on scoutcomics.com. Not sure how much the digital copies are, might still be the four ninety nine, but it could be a little less. Or, you can buy one of the Scout boxes, and you get, uh, I think it's like a dozen books, and you might get this one, but they do have some good books. Um, Everglade Angels is a Scout, um, The Electric Black, I mean, just go check them out, and check out Ninja Nuns. I don't think you'll be sorry. So until next time, I'll see you later.